What's on your mind, Dex? Just wanted to follow up on that deal you mentioned. Some third party that wants to use your facilities? What about it? You said you might want me to assist you. Well, that depends. On what? What's more important to you? Working for me? Or making time with Jocelyn? Dinner. Hey guys, you're early. What are you doing here? Why are you surprised, Jocelyn? Everyone, including yourself, knows that Sunny and I are involved. Well, I'm here to pick up Donna. And it was my understanding that you're not allowed anywhere near my little sister. Well, I'm happy to tell you that that information is outdated. Really? Yes, Sonny and Carly, they reached a new understanding. I had the best day with Donna. So much fun. She's in the kitchen with Pilar having an early supper. Okay, well, I will check in with my mom about the change in rules when I get home. Dad? Sonny isn't home from work yet. Oh, shocking. The family man is too busy obstructing justice or doing whatever it is he does to spend time with his youngest child. So he leaves her with the girlfriend. Lucky Donna. She's still too young to understand where she ranks on Sonny's list of priorities. Sonny's on his way home right now, and I know that he would love to see his daughter and kiss her before you take her back to Carly, so you wait a little while. I could take it, if you can. I didn't go to Jocelyn for help. Okay, I never meant for her to be involved. But she was involved. What happened? I can't, I can't, I can't. Okay, you know what, you can lie to me later. I, Let me see. No, I, I, I don't lie to you. Okay, you can refuse to answer me later. Let me see your side. It's just a crease. It's just a crease? No internal bleeding, no full internal. Oh, so you were shot. God, I shouldn't even be here. Well, you are. And you're bleeding from a gun wound, so give me one good reason why I shouldn't call the cops. I'm asking you not to. I don't know if Jocelyn saved my life, but she definitely saved my freedom. And people know I work for you, boss. If she had called an ambulance or called the cops, you would have been investigated at the very least. Dex, what's your point? Just say it. Jocelyn did me a favor, and I am grateful. That's as far as it goes. Good, because I spent today cleaning up the mess you left behind when you were driving that transfer van to Pettenville. I was concerned that somebody could have identified you as the driver of the van, so I made sure that nobody is going to identify you. I appreciate that, boss. And I promise you, I will learn from my mistakes. I believe that. You mean that when you say it? But like my old man used to say, some mistakes are too big to make. <laughs>